the number one thing that I wish I knew before I went to med school was Stud doing well in your science classes is not the most important thing. Doing research is not the most important thing. The most important thing that a medical school is looking for is, one, that you can do well academically, but two, that you can balance that with a passion of yours, and you could take that passion to a really interesting place. Uh, for example, I was really interested in teaching, and I did a lot of teaching in high school, I did a lot of teaching in college, whether it was teaching um, community building in Washington, D.C., or whether it was teaching organic chemistry or was teaching MCAT courses. It was that that most of my interviewers was most interested in. If I knew that earlier on, I would have been much more eager to build on my interests, my passions, than making sure that my science grades were always up to snuff, that my resume looked like what I thought was medical. The second thing that I wish I knew before entering medical school is the true reality of the time commitment that is involved in being in medical school and after that being a resident. Um, when you go to medical school, when you go to residency, what you'll find is that a lot of your friends going different fields, they really will have a lot more time, a lot more money than you do. Um, you know, for me, I didn't regret that as much because I knew that this is what I always wanted to do in life. It made me happy. I liked learning science. I liked the people around me. But for others, the truth is they weren't as happy. They, didn't, they weren't quite ready for fully committing most of their time, most of their life to medicine. And that's truly what it's going to be because going into medicine isn't just about studying, being a doctor, and going with your life. Medicine almost becomes your life. And that's okay. Um, but you, I did wish I realized that earlier on just so I knew, young tree, this is what you're going into. I don't think it would have changed what I would have had to do, but I think that it would have made me more prepared to jump into the pool. The third thing that I wish I knew before starting medical school was the financial burden that would be involved in just applying to medical school. Um, traveling around, for those of you who aren't able to just kind of bootstrap most of your expenses, is expensive. Hotels, air flight travel, the application themselves, those aren't cheap. So if you've been kind of saving up, if you've worked in high school, I think it would have been important to kind of realize that at the front end, knowing that I have to have a pocket of money in addition to just applying to medical school and just to attending medical school. There's those upfront costs beforehand just to get into medical school. The fourth thing I wish I knew before starting medical school is you'll probably be surrounded by some of the most bright, impressive people you'll ever meet in your entire life and that when you're surrounded by that many people, you shouldn't at all be overwhelmed. You should actually just feel that, wow, look at all these great people I'm surrounded by. When I was, first met my friends in medical school, I'll be honest, I was incredibly intimidated. You know, all these people were so bright, they were so interesting, I was wondering how could I fit in amongst all these great people. But what you have to realize is that school took you. Uh, they were interested in you, they thought you fit in. So no matter how intimidated you are, no matter how much you think that your best friend or your neighbor might be just that much more interesting or that much brighter than you are, you've got talents too. The school saw that. The schools you chose were able to collect that incredible group of people because they're good at it. And they were good enough to pick you. So again, don't be scared. You belong where you go to. The fifth thing that I wish I knew before going to medical school was it's important to take the time out, to have the active motivation to continue to pursue the interests and hobbies that really you know, made you interested in life outside of medicine. It's very easy to get completely consumed in medicine. I think it's, it's, hard, it's so easy to lose those hobbies that it's, it, you can put them on the wayside. For me, I really enjoyed playing tennis. I really enjoyed um, playing racquetball things like that. And I since lost that. And if I could go back, I wish I could have just given myself at least half an hour to an hour a week to really enjoy those extra hobbies that I had on the side. Uh, because I think one of the regrets I have now really is I let my hobbies somewhat slowly erode over time because of how busy things can get.